what it says. <laughs> Where is Mr. Tomato? I cannot see him. Mr. Tomato, what are you doing? <laughs> Hello, guys. I'm at Teacher Anne's home. Mr. Tomato, I know that Robbie Rabbit is not here because he's in Ace Castora. But please behave. Yesterday, you will play with my vacuum cleaner. <laughs> Mr. Tomato, we have a story time. We have the story time today. Are you ready? I think that you already know this story. But well, let's see if you remember it. Okay, so everyone, open your eyes, open your ears, and close your mouth. This is the story of the very, very, very hungry caterpillar. I didn't, you already know. Yes, of course. Okay, let's start. In the light of the moon, a little, little egg lay on a leaf. But one Sunday morning, when the sun came up, pop, out of the egg, a little, little, and very, very hungry caterpillar went out. Do you want to see a caterpillar? Look, it was very, very little. Say hello! Hello! But this caterpillar, guys, was very, very happy. So, it started to do, look for some food. And on Monday, he ate through one apple. But he was still hungry. So, on Tuesday, he ate through two pears, one and two. But he was still hungry. So, on Wednesday, he ate through three plums, look, one, two and three. But this very hungry caterpillar was still hungry. My goodness. So, on Thursday, Thursday, he ate through four strawberries. One, two, three, and four. He ate all of them. Oh my goodness, this is horrible. This caterpillar eats a lot. He was still hungry, so on Friday he ate through one, two, three, four, and five oranges, guys. Five oranges. Oh god. And he was still hungry. Oh going to become a very 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 big caterpillar if he falls like that. So, on Saturday, oh my god guys, you don't want to see this. Oh god. He ate through one piece of chocolate cake. 
one ice cream cone, one pickle, one slice of Swiss cheese, one lollipop, one piece of cherry pie. Oh, good guys, there's so many, many, many things. Oh my goodness. One sausage. One cupcake. And one slice of watermelon. Oh God, guys. So, do you know what happened? Next day, the caterpillar had stomach ache. <laughs> I had stomach ache. I have stomach ache. Oh, my stomach hurts so much. <laughs> so he decided to eat just a little leaf. Do you see it, guys? Now the caterpillar wasn't little anymore. It was a very, very, very big caterpillar. And he built a small house called a cocoon around himself. And he stayed inside for more than two weeks. Many, 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 many days. And then he nibbled a small hole in the cocoon, pushed his way out. And do you know what, guys? A beautiful butterfly appeared. Butterfly fly away. Guys, the caterpillar was no longer a caterpillar. It was a very, very beautiful butterfly. Have you liked the story? Hope so. Are you all good at home? Yes? One thing, remember. Wash your hands, huh? you know, you put the soap, you wash it very, 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 very well. And don't forget, guys, you also have to be very good with your mummies and daddies and sisters and brothers. And although Robbie Rabbit is not here, he has left you a little thing. Stay at home, okay? Bye-bye. See you.